and now to have a $14 trillion national debt and the debate in Washington, D.C. is going on about do we raise the debt ceiling again? Let me tell you what the Keynes doctrine would be. We ain't raising the debt ceiling. We are going to cut the spending. Yes. On the debt limit, you say, don't make a deal. Even John Boehner, who says, let's cut spending at least as much, dollar for dollar, as we raise right. the debt limit, you say that is nothing but a stall tactic. Yes, it is. No. But, but even your plan, yes. and let's say even if they had been able to, to take care of this sooner, Federal Reserve Chairman Ben Bernanke says that your idea, and you're not the only one who's offered it, right. is too dangerous. This is the way he put it. Even if the debt is paid, there's the issue of market confidence and how the market would respond to the risk of default or even the default on non-debt obligation. But, but Bernanke is saying at this point, you've got to make a deal and, and, and you've got to make a deal and raise the debt ceiling. And if you don't and you just pay the debt off, that's still going to frighten the market. And I would agree with them. I, I agree. So then you just said the Kane plan is wrong. No, I did. I said that they allowed themselves to get in this hole. They allowed themselves to get between a rock and a hard place. What I said about identifying those four things and pay those first, if they had done this a year ago, anticipating this, it, it, it would have worked. He's right. But is the Kane plan right or wrong now? The Kane plan can't work now. It cannot work now. Simply because they waited too long. And this is part of the problem.